Oh, I'm going to get you. I can't wait for that. Yes! I can't wait for that bubble. And there it is. Okay. So it looks like the UK is... Le we have 202 fucking points. Love to all and welcome, everybody. My name is Black Hollow and this is Plague Inc. Today we are back with the next plague. It is a virus. Um, and one thing that I didn't mention at the end of the other Plague Inc. video is that every time that you beat a plague, you unlock a certain uh, gene. And on the last one, we unlocked a zero file, which gives our plague a bonus in arid climate. So we're going to go ahead and plug that in right here. Uh, let's continue along, and we're going to go on normal just like last time, and we're going to kill him with kindness. Zugs, thank you so much for that name, man. Welcome to play. Yeah, I already know how to play. Select a start. Okay. So last time, I went with a uh, with a central hub of Mexico. Today, I'm going to be doing the same thing, except instead of Mexico, I'm going to be going with Saudi Arabia. So we're going to start a plague right there. Since we have that bonus, kindness begins in Saudi Arabia. Since we uh, have that bonus of an arid climate boost uh, with a zero file or whatever it is, kindness is a virus. That means that it randomly mutates uh, and can be, or rapidly, mutates rapidly and can be hard to control. It can, it costs DNA points to devolve. Oh, okay. So on the, on the bacteria, when you devolved, uh, anything that mutated, you actually got like two or three points back. So this time, we're actually gonna have to pay to devolve it, and it is already coded to do that straight from the get-go. You, you don't motivate the mutations, they just happen naturally. Good to know. But as I was saying before, we have that zero file boost. So we're gonna get a decent, like, leg up. Oh, we already haven't. You know what? I think I'm gonna go ahead and leave it in there. We're gonna have to play this one smart. We can't constantly go in there and devolve this shit all the time. So we're gonna have to roll with whatever it mutates on. Um, now, like I was saying, we have that arid boost, so we're gonna we're gonna probably see a decent rate of infection. Festival of love in Saudi Arabia. That works for me. Everybody's kissing everybody. Infected jumps to 505. Beautiful. All righty, guys. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Let's kill him with kindness. And we got the cyst symptom. Should I keep cyst? on there I don't know Ooh, I think I'll keep it there it's probably gonna increase infectivity but it's probably gonna get me caught pretty soon here that's okay we're just gonna roll with it like we said before and there's one other thing that I want to do uh, the severity this is something that I learned if your severity is up just a little bit see how the severity went up I'm gonna evolve that right there if the severity is up you actually get more money from popping these bubbles and the DNA bubbles as well. You see that, I got three points from that. That's what I'm talking about. When your severity is up, your points go up. Abscesses, ooh, I don't know if I want the abscesses quite yet. Pockets of infected flesh are painful and act as breeding grounds for the pathogen. Uh, I don't know, I don't know. Um. Let's be ballsy. I'm gonna turn on the systemic infection. Let's see how many people we can infect with what we got right now. Okay, we've spread over into Egypt, it would appear. All right, guys, and we're in Japan. Let's do, and we're in the United States. This is going well. All right, so at this point, I'm actually gonna do something that I should have done by now. I'm gonna upgrade my uh, transmissions through air and water. Unfortunately, that's the most that I can go. I like evening them out by giving air the priority. And it looks like we are discovered. And the first death in Egypt. Are you kidding me? People are already dying? How the fuck are people already dying? How are people already dying from this? Okay, we need we need to spread a little faster here. How are people dying? I, it almost looks like people are dying at a quicker rate than they're being infected. Kindness has mutated and developed the tumor sim- Oh. Okay, there comes a point where actually you should start devolving. So we're gonna get, we're gonna get rid of that. Where are the tumors? Where are the tumors? Internal hep- It evolved like four- Oh, wait, wait. Oh, there's the tumors. Okay, it's not the white. Yeah, I'm gonna devolve that. It's not the white thing. So, okay, let's, uh, let's keep watching where we're going. Damn, this is gonna be difficult. This is gonna be difficult. London Olympics are back on. All righty, sounds good to me. I'm not going. Saudi Arabia shuts down seaports, whatever. I already got you guys. I already got you blanketed like a Snuggie. We are spreading like crazy and getting points like crazy. I need to do this extreme bio aerosol. And I also need to motivate just a little bit more coming out of this side. Now let's uh, let's upgrade this. And, wait a minute, what's this guy? Viral instability. If DNA becomes more unstable, increasing. Oh, so you can upgrade it and get more random mutations. 
Good to know. Good to know. Let's do cold resistance and let's help it out since we have the arid resistance uh, gene type plugged in and we should hopefully start seeing some coverage. Coughing is mutated. World uh, progress. Oh God. No, no, no. Pause. Okay. Ooh, almost missed that one. World uh, cure is at 4%. So we're doing okay. Uh, threat level is increased. You're damn right threat level's increased. I'm about to start dropping some crazy infectivity on you guys. We're going to decrease future uh, research speed, and we're going to increase the drug resistance. I don't know how graceful my intro was to this entire thing. Hypersensitivity symptom. Kindness has mutated and developed the hypersensitivity symptom without using DNA points. Alrighty. Don't know what it is, but I'll take it. Holy fucking infectivity. And it looks like we just got Greenland. Sweden! You're the last one on the list, my friend, and you are landlocked for the most part. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you, Sweden. Oh, I'm gonna get you. I can't wait for that. Yes! I can't wait for that bubble, and there it is. Okay, so it looks like the UK is le We have 202 fucking points. Okay, so we are gonna do a genetic reshuffle on them, and we're going to slow the future research speed. Uh, and I'm also going to, can I, do I really want to do anything else? I think I just want to do the cold at this point. Yeah, let's get the cold uh, upgraded. And I actually think I'm going to go ahead and do the heat as well, just because we have so many fucking points. So I can do this. Environmental hardening. Pathogen develops hardened coding. Coding becomes highly weather resistant and extremely comfortable in both hot and cold environments. Let's go ahead and do that. And what's the cure at right now? The cure is at 24%. So I think I'm gonna do another genetic reshuffle and knock them down one more time. Here we go, guys. Let's start infecting people in Greenland and Canada. There it goes, rash symptom, he's mutated. There it goes, oh my God, look at that number going up. Here we go, guys. We are about to infect everybody in the world. Fever symptom has been mutated. Let's see if maybe I can, uh, no, I don't wanna start doing anything like that just yet. We're at 36%, oh my God, we're at 36%. Uh, kindness genes manipulated. Scientists have introduced synthetic genes to kindness. Who researchers say that this break... Oh, God. 42%. Shit. Oh, shit. I need to start killing them, though. Oh, fuck. Okay, uh, we're gonna... Oh, sh oh shit. Uh, this is gonna be the biggest jump for lethality right here. So we're gonna do that one. And then that... Oh, my God. That's a big jump. Yep. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Uh, total organ failure. Whole world... Please start dying. There are no healthy people left in the world. Please die quicker. Please die quicker. Seizures are mutated. We're at 50% to the cure. Let's see if we can stay on top of this. Are we going to beat it? Italy begins to break down. Oh my God. Are we going to do it? Am I actually going to do it? Swearing symptom mutated. Oh shit, you guys. Or the sweating symptom, not the swearing symptom. I can't believe I said swearing. It looks like we're going to do it, I think. Let's get back in there and let's give them one more. Let's give them, uh, let's give them a coma and uh, come on let's evolve it and what else can i give for lethality has it got anything else for lethality i don't think so uh ooh, that makes severity go up i can get some more muns from that Alrighty, central america is in anarchy well not for long because uh you all are about to be dead i can't believe i did it i actually did it let's keep uh let's let's spend all of our money let's do everything that we possibly can do before we win, because I know that we're gonna win this one. We got 10 DNA points left, guys. Here we go. Tumor symptom is mutated. We've got less than a billion people. Oh my God. <laughs> Here it goes. Down to the tens of millions and the single millions, down into six digits nearly. We did it. Kindness killed everyone. Kindness to eradicate humans. That's right. Goodbye, humans. We got you. Kill them with kindness. Thanks for the name again, Zugs. Really appreciate it, homie. Let's wait. Oh, I was going to try to pause it right before, but it got to zero. Ah, victory. Kindness has successfully eliminated all life on Earth. Beautiful. Let's speed it up and watch the recap. That was awesome, you guys. I actually got in and played about two minutes of it, um, and I got accustomed to the different mutations. I did get a, a different path, but I just forgot to enable my recording, so um, I, I had to go back and, you know, quit out and, and get back into the game. But that tells you how quick this was. Even though you don't get a good start to the plague, that doesn't necessarily mean you're not going to do it. 629 to 630 days to kill everybody in the world. That is just under two years' time. 
climb. That's crazy to me. That is nuts. And that's probably a pretty realistic idea of what would happen if something really did sweep over the world. It wouldn't be just like a five day to a week long, month long thing. It would really take some time. So um, yeah, I'm really loving this game. You guys, please leave a comment down below and let me know uh, what you want to see for next uh, episodes or Plague's title. I would love to get your suggestions on that. I've got a couple of my own, but I mean, the, just involving you guys in the channel is, I, I love doing that kind of thing. Um, so yeah, thanks for your support of this series, and I hope you enjoyed this episode. I can't wait for the next one. So friends, if you enjoy what you see, and only if, leave a little love in the comment section or leave a like and subscribe so you don't miss the rest of Plague Inc. and whatever comes next. As usual, enjoy the rest of your day, and I will see you guys again.